Here we're going to take a look at digital terrain modelling with CADI, turning 2D drawings into 3D site models, producing site sections instantly, and optimising cut and fill to reduce the transit of materials to and from site. Aerial photographs and site survey drawings offer some insight into the problems or opportunities a, a site has to offer. However, we really need to start looking at this in three dimensions to gain a proper understanding of what the site is all about. Here we see an example of a site survey drawing that has all the levels noted on the site uh, in text uh, with block references to mark their position. Time consuming and the possibility of making mistakes trying to do that sort of thing manually. Here we see how Caddy can transform these simple text and points on the drawing and create from them a 3D profile of the site. And having created our 3D profile we can then produce from this a 3D tin or triangular irregular network. And this gives us the 3D surfaces on which we can better judge our site. To create these 3D tin models of our site Caddy uses Delaunay triangulation, a system invented by a Russian mathematician Boris Delaunay. Having created our 3D tin models we can then provide contour maps showing valuable insight into the steep or sloping nature of the ground. And where we want to modify our site to create, say, flat sections for placing our buildings on, then Caddy gives us the tools to level our sites. With Caddy, we can even carry out cut and fill operations on our site, taking account of the material that the site's made up of for bulking factors, calculating the amount of cut and fill to be as, as minimal as possible so that environmental impact on our works is minimised. Having carried out any modifications to our site we can now look at taking some sections through. When done by hand this is a very laborious process and not without the peril of getting things wrong either but with Caddy it's simply a case of picking one end of the section line to the other we can even include a datum uh, as well as the level information noted at the side of the section. You'll notice that the tin models are quite angular. This is why Caddy has the facility to produce from these tin models 3D meshes which affords much greater opportunity for smoothing and giving a more natural appearance to the contours of the site. And by rotating our site model we can get a, a much better idea of what problems the site holds. So to sum up, Caddy offers us a really easy solution to digital terrain modelling helping us develop difficult sites by letting us take 2D drawings, convert them into 3D site models, produce site sections in seconds, and optimise cut and fill to help us reduce environmental impact.